So, I have two monitors connected to my computer and I also have a few Steam games installed. The thing is that when I start these games, I want them to start on this monitor, the one that's being recorded right now. But let's see what actually happens. So I'll try to start Fallout New Vegas. And then I have the option screen, let me drag it over. And then when I click on play, the game starts, but it starts on the other monitor. So that's why you can see it right now, because it's running, but it's running on the other monitor. And I want it to run on this monitor, the one that's being recorded. So first, let's close the game. And now I'll restart it. And once again, we get this settings menu. The importance of this settings menu is that it allows us to ask the game to run within a window. So instead of using the entire screen, it will only be shown within a window. To do that, I choose options. And here we have windowed mode. Now, the way to set it is a bit different for every game, but in many games, you will be able to enable windowed mode, and it usually can be found in the display settings. Now, as for the resolution, you should never use the full resolution of your screen when using a windowed mode. So to check the resolution of your screen, you can right click on your desktop and open the display settings. And if we scroll down a bit, we can see the display resolution, which in my case is 1920 by 1080. So back for the game resolution, I won't use it because I don't want the game to use the full resolution while in windowed mode. So I'll choose the second best, the next option. Then I can click on OK. And when we start the game now, once again, it started in the second monitor. But this time, since it's within a window, we can drag it over to this monitor it's a bit tricky, but it seems like I finally got hold of it, and here it is, and I could drag it over to this screen, and now I can play the game while it's being displayed over here in this screen. So we have this option, but it's not a perfect solution because the game doesn't use the entire screen. So we have an alternative method that may sometimes work. So first, let's close this game. And to show the other method, I start my other game, which is RimWorld. And as you can see, it started within a window. Now under options, we have the graphics options. And here we can turn full screen on or off. So if I turn it on, it uses the entire screen. And now I cannot drag it, of course. But if I turn full screen off, it only uses a window. And now I can drag this window over. But the second option I wanted to show works even if you are in full screen mode. So all we need to do is press Shift, Windows, and then an arrow key, either left or right. In my case, the game is now on the right monitor. So I'll press Shift, Windows, and the left arrow, and it immediately jumped over to my other monitor. And if I now press Shift, Windows, and the right arrow, it jumps back to this monitor. This method is really great, but it won't work for every game. Another thing you might try is using the Windows desktop options. So let's close RimWorld. And what I'll do now is right click on my desktop and choose Display Settings. And here I'll make sure that the Multiple Displays tab is shown. And I'll change the main display. So right now, Monitor 1 is the main display. But if I now choose Monitor 2, you can see that it's not the main display. So let's make it the main display. And if I try to run my game now, so first let's turn off the windowed mode. And if we start the game now, it starts on this monitor because this one is now the main display. And if all these methods fail for you, you can always force Windows to only use the monitor you want. So once again, I right click on my desktop and choose display settings. And now instead of extending the display over my two monitors, I'll only use monitor two. And now the first monitor completely turned off and Windows only uses this monitor, the second monitor. So if I start my game now, 
Windows has no choice but to start the game on this monitor because this is the only active monitor.